Hello everybody, Vikingsman18 here, about to start a much anticipated series that I've been wanting to do since they've announced that it's coming back in this year's game, and that will be my career mode in WWE 2K16. This is officially the very first video I am recording for WWE 2K16. This is release day. I am recording this after I got off work, which was 10 p.m. Actually, technically this isn't release day anymore, because I'm actually filming this right now at 12.51 in the morning. And, uh, I'm, I'm ready to play it. The reason I'm playing it so late, guys, is because I didn't get off work until 10 p.m. at night. And, uh, after I did everything I had to do when I got home, I, uh, I spent about an hour making a guy so I can import him into my career, which will make it fast and simple. I did the entrance, I did the move set, so it should all be in there. I pray to God it is, or else I wasted my time. A uh, couple things to note, if you'll notice there is no music playing, that is because I do not want to get a content ID match for a stupid licensed song. I already know it'll get content ID, so I turned it all off like I did last year. So without further ado, let's do my career. New. Online features not available, yeah I know, for some reason I couldn't connect to the server. Import. Me. This superstar has parts that you haven't unlocked yet. These locked parts will be reverted back to default parts. There won't be an effect on the original data. Yeah. Now, which parts are blocked? That's what I want to know. All these locked items. In my career, yada 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 yada, yeah. Wait a minute, they changed my clothing. What the hell? What the hell? They took away my top. Just want to make sure this is all right. I don't care about the crowd signs. Yo, come on. Why are these locked? Oh, I have to unlock them first. That's stupid. What does it mean, three more stories? Guys, the outfit I had, I was actually kind of excited about. My entrance, uh, my ring attire is the same, but I lost my arm guards that I had. My entrance uh, top was the same one that Seth Rollins used at a Night of Champions, that really nice gold and white one. That's why I made the pants a metallic white or silver. And I was going to do that because if I kept it that like that, I was going to be able to like keep it white and gold for when I was a good guy, and then maybe turn it like black and red if I became a bad guy, but... Looks like they took it away, but uh, I guess when I unlock it, I'll add it back on for now. But I guess we'll just stick with this for now since it took away everything else. I really hope it didn't affect my entrance, that's all I'm saying. No, I don't want to turn that on. Yeah, I don't care about that, to be honest. They better not have screwed up my entrance, that's all I'm saying. Because I like the way my entrance was. Welcome to the Performance Center. I know you had a lot of offers on the table. And I'm glad you chose to go with the WWE. We know how talented you are, and we want to put you on the fast track to the NXT title. Now go get warmed up. I have a matchup for you once you're ready to go. Who's that in the ring? Finn Balor, and I couldn't tell who the other guy was. Oh, guys, I'm so excited for the game this year. This is going to be cool.
especially because they uh, updated a lot of things I had in issues with with my career mode. From what I've seen, they've updated it. So, my career home. Okay, we got like a schedule, and we're at NXT. This is your home. From here, you can view the match card, browse the rankings for all the titles, upgrade your My Superstar, among other things. Let's start by choosing rankings and selecting a WWE Championship to go for. Okay, I just want to... My overall is a 60, the authority, my allies, wow. Character, Hall of Fame, retire, yes, let's retire. This is the ranking stream. From here, you can target which championship you want to go for. Once you choose a championship, raise your popularity by winning matches and making the right decisions out of the ring. For now, choose NXT Championship by pressing X. Kevin Owens is the number one contender. By joining the rankings for a new championship, you will lose your place in any other rankings. Rank 10 in your new championship ranking. Are you sure you want to join the rankings for this championship? Yes. You are now going after the NXT Championship. To move up the rankings, you need to get into rivalries with other superstars, win matches, and put on good post-show interviews. Through this, you'll gain popularity, which moves you up the rankings, dismiss this message, and press zero to go back to the home screen. Circle, I mean, not zero. <laughs> I was just wondering what would happen. <laughs> yes, go for the WWE Championship right now. This is your first match. Once in NXT, you'll be able to view the entire match card from here. For now, press X to go to your first match. Uh, f before we do any of that... Okay. Yes, subtitles on. That's what I wanted to do. Keep the difficulty at normal for now. Do they keep it the same? I don't care if you guys see my layout for the entrance. I had uh, Jericho's Titan Tron, Brock Lesnar's ribbon thing, the uh, the ring ribbon thing, uh, Finn Balor's music and entrance, but not the Demon Finn Balor, or Finn Balor, however you pronounce it, but the, uh, the normal one. You have the Demon version and the normal. So let's see if they screwed me. Nope, they kept it the same. Cool. For some reason, they don't have any Shawn Michaels stuff on there. Which makes me... Well, they have to have Shawn Michaels stuff on there. So, Because you guys know I usually put HBK as like my video in the, the ribbon thing. But for some reason, there wasn't. So I wonder if it's because you have to unlock it. That's probably why. Which is fine. Because you can always update this as you go. manager from this screen you can purchase and uh, allocate a manager managers can help you by distracting the referee in your favor certain ones are more effective oh, I can get Paige as my manager that's what I wanted last time or Lana but they're heel no not Paige as a face you know who I'm going after guys I'm going for Paige and then maybe Lana when I'm a heel Okay, I can't do anything on here, so I'm not even going to check that out. Okay, who is that in the ring we got? Not in the ring. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Next pay-per-view, NXT Arrival. Uh, it looks like I'm prideful and a heel. I guess I'm kind of like dead in the middle, but I'm assuming. This is the match card for the current show you are in. From here, you can view your matchup along with everybody else's. Later on, you'll be able to interact with other superstars' matches. For now, though, you'll just be able to continue your own match. Enzo Amore. I'm liking this so far. I'm liking it. Now, are they going to have stories in this? Or is this literally just going to be like, you have different rivals and you do different matches? If that's the case, it's going to be kind of boring. So please tell me you have stories in this. Alright, so today you'll be training with Enzo Amore. He's going to help you learn a few things. Get in there and we'll get started. Let's do this A-Train. Or Tensai. Albert, whatever you prefer. 
or of course your real name. Okay, the normal collar, collar and elbow tie-up. Ow, what are you doing? It's just like last year. Okay, let's start by getting into a gravel position. Then we'll go from there. Yes. No. No. Stop it. Ah, oh, he got out. Great job. Let's move to something else. Get into position. In position for what? I didn't even do anything, he just did that. What the heck's happening? Dude, my game's glitching. Dude, I'm glitched. Oh. What's going on, dude? Get that down. Good. Let's keep it moving. Why don't you actually let me control the character instead of automatically doing the grapples by itself? I thought we had to hold it and it went by itself. That's why I was like, I messed up the first two. That's what I wanted to see. I think that's good for now. Go take a break. Hey, he's actually being nice to me on like Bill DeMont last year. Not like Bill DeMont telling me I was trash. I love that attire right there, that's awesome. By the way guys, this episode will probably go about 20 to 25 minutes. And uh, we'll probably keep the episodes around that length every time, maybe around 30. 
But you don't want to make it too long because then people lose interest. I like this. I really do. So far. Tyler Breeze. We're still 10. Why am I still a heel? Take that much. We'll just go up to 60 for now. 62, I guess. Update some of this stuff. Damn. It goes from 44 to Trying to kind of even evenly distribute what I can. Perfect. Abilities cost money, correct? Oh no, they call SP too. Ooh, I didn't know that. Okay, this is like the normal stuff. Okay. I just wanted to check that out. Ooh, sorry if you heard that, guys. I accidentally hit my, cha oh, my table. <laughs> Oops. So is this a match or is this another training match? Okay, it's another training match. Against Tyler Breeze. Alright, I want to see what you could do in a real match. I'm pairing you up with Tyler Breeze. He's a former number one contender for the NXT title. A former number one contender. Him, we'll be sure to debut you at NXT in the near future. I think Tyler Breeze, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, just debuted in SmackDown this past week. So it looks like he got a main roster call up. Good for him, he's a good wrestler. All right, we just added the match rating. Rating. I, I just said rating. We just added the match rating display at the top left of the screen. It will tell you how entertaining your match is. Whenever you do something exciting in the ring, the match rating display will tell you. The goal in any match is to get a five star rating. You just did something in the ring that moved your match rating up or down. Things such as not performing the same move twice and performing oh my god moments raise your match rating. As you play more matches, you will learn what raises and lowers. Okay, press R2 at the right moment just before getting hit to counter your opponent's attack. Performing a reversal uses up a reversal slot. Reversal slots regenerate over time. The number of reversal slots will vary with each superstar. 
The number is determined by the reversal attribute. Some attacks have two reversal opportunities, a minor reversal and a major reversal. The minor reversal opportunity is highlighted in green. The major is highlighted in red. Performing this reversal will weaken your opponent, giving you a brief advantage. Oh god, he did that fast. Oh my lord, he's filling that up really fast. Screw you. Ah! Oh. Good lord, I forgot how much I suck when you first start. It doesn't seem like it kept my moves. Yep, it changed my moves. Now, oh no, I didn't mean to hit the taunt. No, I didn't want to do that move. trying to weaken him so I know that I can get the win when I do my finisher. I don't even know what my finisher is. Seriously?
That's my finisher. Are you serious? I'm not using no freaking submission. These moves suck. This is a really big training match. don't like this new submission system to be honest see it's so retarded it changes direction on you the entire time what the heck you what Okay. Okay, that's my match rating. Four star match. Ow! He hit me with a freaking chair! The AI purposely got himself disqualified. Okay, guys. I'm probably going to end it after this. Because there's no way in hell I'm using a submission as my finisher. So I gotta change some things. Oh god. What is that? Me and Baron Corbin versus the Vault Villains? Huh. Okay, we gotta we gotta change some things here. I don't know why my accent went southern all of a sudden, but yeah. Full Nelson, are you kidding me? That's what I had. I had the Stone Cold Stunner. Signature, huh? Don't know what I should do, to be honest. Maybe a Twist of Fate? No, that's in the corner.
I don't know what to do. Yeah, we should do the... Let's do the stink face down here. Good God. Maybe a spine buster? That's like triple H's right there. I like that one. We'll do that. I don't really want to do a Shining Wizard. The Rude Awakening, that's pretty cool. That they have that in there. Oh, this is a Pages uh, finisher, finishing submission move. Page Turner. Mr. McMahon Stunner. Didn't know he got his own stunner. Then again, I guess that was always his finishing move in all the other games. They still have the K2 in here. Even though Kelly Kelly hasn't been in since 2013. Well, she left the company in 2012. But WWE 13 was the last game she was in. Uh, GTS is kind of a big move just to use for a sign- I mean, yeah, a signature. Uh, I don't know what to do. Hmm, this is hard. That's pretty cool. I might use one of these as a signature, to be honest. I like the neck breaker. Let's go with that. I'm not worried about all that right now. See, I, I changed all this, and they screwed it up. I'm just going to go with random things for now. We'll go with that. Go with that. <laughs> I'm just trying to get different moves for now, just so it's not the default stuff. Eventually, I'm going to go in and, you know, spend more time looking at it. Oh, the Gut Buster's fine. I don't like that stalling suplex. Yeah, let's do the X Factor.
<laughs> just toss them. Oh, I already had that crap. <laughs> There we go, that works. I like the belly to belly, so that works. All of those work for now. Yeah, change the head crank, I hate that. And we'll go with that. I like the power bomb. Just go with the basic arm crusher for now. Go with the forearm drop. And we'll just keep that for now, guys. At least we have somewhat of a different moveset now. We definitely went over the time I wanted. I said around the 20 to 25 minute mark, and we're sitting at 36. But that match went a lot longer than, longer than I thought it would. And I didn't expect to do this on, uh, on the video, but... Who cares? Well, all right, guys, that will end my first My Career video. I actually really enjoyed uh, everything so far. We're only a little bit into it, but it's really fun so far. I like everything they've been changing. Like I said, the only thing I hope is that they don't uh, only make it like this, where you just keep challenging for titles and all that. I really hope that they do have stories. I'm praying they have stories. Uh, let, me, let me know in the comments if you know if they do or not. Don't spoil anything if they do, but just let me know if they have them. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the first of many My Career videos. And as always, I'll be seeing you guys for more 2K16 later on. Have a good one.